Hello ladies and gentlemen, I have the Superboy S. This is a portable pocket Super Nintendo console. Now these have been out for a little while now, but I finally got around to getting my hands on one of these. Now, you know, these are for people who, you know, you have from back in the day collected your, you have your large collection of like Super Nintendo cartridges. And, you know, you just have that nostalgia, you know, it was good. You know, these these gave good memories playing back in the day, you know, feeding carts into these consoles and playing Super Mario Brothers, Gradius, um, you know, Donkey Kong Country, uh, Contra, you name it. Anyway, so, this little console is designed to play the Super NES cartridges. And as an added bonus, in addition to playing Super NES cartridges, um, you can also play Super Famicom uh, games as well. So those of you who are familiar with the Japanese counterpart to the Super Nintendo uh, that was launched in Japan, uh, Super Famicom, those cartridges as well work on this Hyperkin. Um, now speaking of uh, compatibility, um, it also uh, actually has an NTSC and a PAL switch, so you can actually switch between NTSC formats and PAL formats, so it can play both of them. It comes with a gorgeous 4.3 inch LED screen, and uh, there's some other little features as well, which I will show you when I take it out of the box. Speaking of which, we shall take it out of the box right now. Yeah, she does look nice. There's a little bit of foam here to protect the screen. And there's the Superboy. That's pretty pretty uh, large... Uh, uh, handheld it's not something that you put in your pocket but you can carry it around nonetheless and the reason it's this big obviously is because I mean if you remember the size of these NES carts they weren't small but it's designed at the top see at the top here you put them in the top and you're supposed to play the game just like that anyway so uh, before we turn it on what else do we have in here um, we have this nice little box here with some accessories. So in here we have a pouch, a wrist strap, a micro USB charging cable, and an AV cable. All right. So let's take these out here. your pouch so here's a nice big felt pouch for your Superboy S you have a little instruction manual it comes with and here's the USB cable mini USB on one side regular USB uh, 2.0 on the other side AV cable of course and a wrist strap all right all this nice stuff that you get with the Superboy S. So this does look nice. It does feel pretty comfortable in your hand. So at the back here, there's a rechargeable lithium-ion battery. All right, so it's already in its case here and you have a little screw here. So let's just look at the uh, battery. Now with this battery, when fully charged, they do claim you can get up to 10 hours of gameplay on a single charge. Okay, so here's the battery. So this is a 3.7 volt, 4400 milliampere hour battery, which is pretty sizable. Um, so I can definitely believe that you can get about 10 hours of gameplay on a single charge. It's a pretty large battery. Um, considering the fact that it's you're just simply playing 16-bit games, um, I can definitely see you getting a lot of hours of gameplay. So, if you're on a long uh, a long flight or a long train ride, um, you don't have to worry about running out of battery power. Now here you have the headphone jack, here's a volume uh, controller, and here is your brightness button. All right top we have a left and right shoulder button right and here we have our mini USB port 
you have our LED here it gives you you know your 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 power indicator and here we have our PAL NTSC rocker switch here's our reset button and here's our on off button and here's the AV out so here's where you, you connect your AV out cable to the back of a large screen television set and what I like about this uh, cartridge B is that the doors when you're not using any cartridges these doors here keep uh, the internals free from dust and other debris um, right so there's the see in the back there's the little slot uh, little uh, dock dock for your SNES cartridge and your Super Famicom cartridges and here we have our gorgeous 4.3 inch screen now and here we have our select and start buttons and here we have our customary um, Super Nintendo look and feel uh, buttons here so same color scheme uh, your of course your customary Nintendo D-pad for action buttons right now one of the great feature about this it has the AV out uh, port at the back right so of course you can use this connect it to your television set now if you have um, original SNES controllers the wired ones that's where these two ports come into play because what you can do you can connect your Super Nintendo um, game pads directly into these ports you have a left and the right one and you hook this up to your television set and you pretty much have an, uh, an SNES console uh, hooked up to your TV and you put your carts in the back of course and you play like how you used to play your SNES games so it's really cool because you have the portable feature because you have this great lovely screen and then if you want to play it at home as a console you just hook it up to the TV hook up your controllers to there and you're good to go I mean the fact that it plays PAL and NTSC format games uh, and you can put, put in your Super Famicom cartridges as well as your traditional uh, SNES cartridges um, it's it's a, it's a great buy now I got this for about uh, uh, about 90 Canadian so it's about 80 or so US dollars or 70 US dollars whatever the whatever the exchange rate is but you know sub sub $100 so it's pretty affordable as well and if you know anybody who has a soft spot for 16-bit gaming uh, your husband your boyfriend your sister your mom whoever uh, even if it's your little kid you can actually get one of these and let me see what gaming was really like back in the in the 90s pretty decent sound as well so there's some a left and right speaker here you can see here at the front and the sound quality is pretty decent all right, turn it down. So you have those, and of course you have the. You can use it. You can use headphones if you want. All right, let's play some Gradius, man. So guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. Um, feel free to leave some comments down below, uh, and uh, definitely subscribe. And uh, and I strongly recommend you subscribe because we are about to start our giveaways pretty soon um, on a monthly basis. So you know you want to be able to know what we're giving away and when we're giving it away. So in order to get access to that information, you need to be subscribed. So if you do do that right now. And anyway, until then, guys, happy gaming. And happy 16-bit gaming. And uh, yeah, so till next time, guys. Hi, everybody. So I hope you enjoyed that video. Now, two quick things that I need you to do right now. One is hit the subscribe button below this video. And I strongly urge that you do subscribe to this channel because what we've started doing now, end-of-month giveaways. Now, to be eligible to win uh, a prize at the end of the month, what you have to be 
you have to be subscribed to this channel. So subscribe, press that subscribe button below. That's step number one. So it's a two-step process to be eligible to win. One, subscribe. That's very, very important. Two, go on to our website at www.redtechbot.com. And on that website, on the top right-hand corner, there's a newsletter uh, that you must subscribe to. Enter your email address in that, and that's it. You are eligible. You will be eligible to win our, our end of month uh, prize draws. Now, I just repeat myself one more time. Number one, hit the subscribe button below this video to subscribe to this channel. That's one of the requirements. And two, you have to go onto our website at www.redtechbot.com and subscribe to our newsletter. In that newsletter, you'll get all the details about what's being given away at the end of the month, uh, who the winners are, and other important news as well. And in terms of getting more information on how the drawer is going to work and you know, how are you going to pick the, uh, the individual, how are we going to communicate and everything, uh, all the details will be on our website as well at www.redtechbot.com. So until next time, happy gaming and have a good one guys. Okay, so see you later guys.